as I'm completing my master's, I'm realizing that there's a lot of doors that are starting to open up and opportunities that definitely were not there before I started this master's program that are now opening up not only in my school, but in the state and some national stuff as well. I'm Michael Hathorne and I'm finishing the MAT program. Hartford High School has been very supportive to me. Uh, they have given me the time that I've needed and made sure that I'm supported in my classroom. They've actually let me teach online this course that I've been creating. So I've had tremendous support from my, from my school and they feel like they're getting a better teacher out of the deal. Yeah, coming into this, uh, my, my goal for a capstone wasn't to create a course. My goal was to teach teachers how to teach with technology. And it changed really quick because as I started my education at Marlboro, I realized I didn't know nearly enough about technology to teach teachers how to do it. I had my students create 3D buildings in SketchUp, and those buildings were designed to go in the 3D layer in Google Earth and each of the buildings is associated with a history that the students write. So the end product is their work, their history, their buildings are all live in Google Earth's 3D layer in their hometown. It's a progressive course. It starts as a class where I'm teaching the technology of SketchUp, and then I'm teaching the integration of SketchUp into Google Earth, and then we get into the, how do you, how do you research a building? Because buildings can't talk. Very few people write about buildings, so there's, you can't go to the library and research a building. So I have to teach interview techniques because most histories behind buildings are within the people that built it, work there, live there, and then that's where the his, history piece comes. And they throw their interview work and papers that they write, they put it in digital form with their, with their buildings so anyone can view it. I use SketchUp as the, as the hook. Uh, students in general don't like historical research. It's, it's dull, it's dry, it's boring. The technology of SketchUp makes them very interested. And when they're working on the buildings, now all of a sudden learning the history behind the building that they spent a week to create is something they want to do versus something they feel like they have to do. If I were to reverse it and have them do the history first and then teach them the technology, we wouldn't have nearly the quality that we have, but the technology is the real hook that gets them interested in the, in the history. Uh, what I found was I, I use far more technology in my classroom and the video tutorials that I've used in my online course I'm now providing to my face-to-face -face students and they're finding that those are as useful as my actual lectures. <laughs> the statement's true, the more I learn the less I know and there's a lot out there that I'd still love to learn that I was exposed to at Marlboro.